Among others, uh, the uh, long-suffering, one might argue, Arden Farhi, uh, getting uh, some great and deserved space time uh, there, Major. Dare I ask, dare I ask, dare I posit what you might miss on that road to somewhere? I miss the American public. I mean, the great thing about covering a presidential campaign is you meet the country. You get reattached to the country you live in. And it's a great honor. It's a great privilege. I know it sounds corny, but I mean it 100% getting a chance to see as much of the country as you get a chance to see during a presidential campaign and meet as many voters as you get a chance to meet is the best part of covering a presidential campaign. It's certainly much better in the early stages, small events in Iowa, New Hampshire, South Carolina to be sure. But the fact of the matter is the Trump rallies were different in kind and in context in American presidential history. They were large the crowds were enthusiastic. They weren't always necessarily welcoming of reporters, but I never had any particularly negative encounters. And I had a chance to meet a lot of great people in this country, and that's always the best part of a presidential campaign. One thing I will say about that last on the road to somewhere, obviously it may not be the last. We'll see about that. <laughs> yeah, who are you but kidding? But <laughs> point of personal pride, and yeah. I do take a good deal of pride in this. One of the things I do in my life when I'm not doing this, which seems like I'm doing this every hour of every day until my eyes bleed, but that's another story. I'm an amateur photographer, so every picture that you just saw there that didn't have me in it or a CBS staffer in it was mine. All those artistic pictures or semi-artistic pictures, perhaps I'm being too complimentary of myself, were mine. <laughs> and uh, that's something I take a little bit of pride in. As I like well being you a should. photographer. I like being a photo bug. And that's, a, that's one of the things in life that keeps me going. Look, you've got the keenest eye, uh, Major, and I say this, uh, and I know, I know there of uh, which I say, uh, with homage to the great Vince Scully, you're the best one-man booth in politics, and uh, it is, uh, you, make us, you, made, you made us better each and every day, even if most days you had no idea where you were, uh, <laughs> as, as ever, Major. Uh, we, we very much appreciate it. Very kind of you to say, thanks.